Hey everyone, what's up? Cindy and June Stump here again, and we're back. Um, so we're back in our sunken island world, and um, you can see my house has made a bit of progress since last time, even though it's not much. Um, yeah, but it's still some. So I decided to finish off the house, considering that, well, do a bit more to it, considering I thought, you know, you, you wouldn't really want to see me just sitting around placing blocks of wood so this episode we're gonna secure food instead of watching me do all that boring stuff so first of all the thing that um, we should do is um, sort of upgrade our tools because you have to admit we're not doing much with in terms of technology here we've got a stone pickaxe silk touch and try and get stone tools for all the rest of our items so let's mine some stone here <laughs> Um, just enough to probably make a sword and an axe and a shovel that should um, make us well and also we need some for building as well because even though it seems a bit newbie for now it's a lot better than wood in terms of building even though it doesn't look as good um, and because it's got silk touch um, this is a lot easier to mine because we get I think maybe twice the amount of items sometimes we mine yeah and so that's really good and so we're just heading back to the base now um, so I'm thinking about the adventure map. Um, I'm trying to not. I'm trying to do the let's play without spoiling anything. So uh, we're just gonna be careful when we go around the island. So there's our sword done, and then that should help us secure some food, some cows. Yeah. Um, and also let's make a shovel. Actually, we don't need. We've already got a shovel. Okay. So let's sort out this because we've already got the heck happened there. Uh, so we've already got loads of rubbish in our inventory, um, get rid of them uh, keep water, but no, get rid of that, um, get rid of that I can't remember getting half of this stuff, um, and also we need to make a furnace as well so we can cook our food afterwards and we'll keep a fishing rod on us so we can get some fish um, I think that's about it for now, uh, get rid of the wool, we don't need that okay, let's secure ourselves some meat come here cow um, at a later stage, we'd probably end up building a wooden fence, and I would probably end up breeding the cows, so it'd be a lot easier. I'd kill some sheep as well. <laughs> um, yeah, we need. Oh, so annoying when you can't sprint because of hunger. That's one of the main disadvantages with this game. And I think I might have built this house a bit too small, but oh well. Uh, so let's just craft this. I don't know why I'm putting two in. I'm not planning to build two, but I did in a way. Got one there, and put that block of wood in for now. And let's cook our beef. Um, and also, we could use these saplings. So I've, as you can see, I've planted quite a few already out here, so we don't really need any more. So if that runs out, yeah, you just put more in. Because apparently saplings last for five seconds each inside a furnace, which isn't much, but when you have no other use for them, it's sort of good. And so, yeah, we've got that. Um, so basically now, I'm planning to get some fish. So I'm not sure if you can fish here because it's been terraformed, but they gave us that for a reason. Actually, let's eat first. That got our hunger back, back up a bit. And also you can see in the latest sort of versions of Minecraft, you can get XP for cooking stuff as well, rather than just killing animals. Um, so hopefully we can catch a fish. It's just a waiting game. Now. Let's see if we can do it. Ready? And... Nope. There is that method of spamming the right click button, but I'd rather do it properly. Uh, let's go over here. Uh, um, uh, I'm not sure if that's even working. It looks like it glitched out there. Okay, let's wait. I want to catch one fish before this episode's over. That's that's my goal. Even though we've got one already, we still would like another. Come on. Come on. Come on. I think that sheep might be distracting them or something. I'm not sure. Right. Yes. Yep, one fish. There you go. And so, food for now, I think we're basically sorted. What enchantment does this have? Knockback. Oh. <laughs> so, if 
if we're ever trapped in the corner with a creeper trying to kill us, we can always knock it back with our fishing rod. Yeah, that's right. Um, so that should save us, apparently. Oh, look, it's more steak that we can eat. Fill up our hunger bar. And... Yep, that's done. The thing I would like to do is get some armour. Well, more armour. And then um, to actually... Um, explore some of this island and take some resources with us so we can see what to do. Oh, we've got another fish in here. Uh, I don't remember catching it, but I won't. Let's wait for this to cook. Oh, I hope there's enough wood. No, there probably isn't. That's another thing we need to do. We need to chop down some more che trees. Cheese? Cheese? You can't even get cheese. I know there's a mod for it though, but <laughs> oh, I think we've got just enough. Yeah, perfect amount there. Um, let's keep them on us for now. Put that stupid furnace away that I accidentally built. And yeah, so um, if we try and get some more wood, then we can hopefully build a door to our house so it's a bit safer. Oh, that's another thing. We need oh, we need to punch wood so that we can build an axe to chop down wood. Oh, it's a never-ending circle. But yep, yeah, punching wood like a pro. Um, so we'll get yep. Yeah, um, so we'll get some more wood and let's get the axe. Nope, no more saplings. Oh, well, we've got plenty. Oh, no, I burnt them all, but who cares? We can always just get more. Um, planks. And what are we doing? Let's just get five overall sticks for now, and that should be good. And there we go. Our axe. That's it. And so now this can help us chop down trees a lot faster. Oh, it's getting to night time. Uh, I might want to sleep for morning. The one bad thing about Minecraft is it's always a bit ominous about where you place your bed because it can also uh, quite often be a bit awkward. You can end up spawning in the middle of the night with loads of monsters around you, just slaughtering you. So that's not what we want. Um, so I'll just put this door down to stop any running in, even though it's the wrong way. <laughs> and so let's sleep into the morning. Oh. Okay, so we're back. It's the morning. Just slept through the night. Well, Minecraft night. And so we're just going to finish off chopping down um, some of these trees. And actually we'll replant some saplings. Because the way this island was designed, it's designed really well. And I don't want to um, ruin the look of it. Because that's probably what it's about. Um, for look. And probably even the um, features of the island. And the way it's built specifically for like resources and playing on it. So, ooh. So another mushroom. Yeah, we could breed them, so I won't let them die quite yet. And I'll remember right where the trees were before I cut them down. And I'd say that's enough wood for now. Four hunger bar, bit of food to spare. It's not bad. Okay. Oh, and an apple. Yeah. I think they're quite rare. It's like a one in, one in two hundred chance of dropping per leaf. Yeah. So quite lucky, even though they're pointless. But when we go to the Nether at some stage, we can. Um, transform them with um, golden nuggets into um, a golden apple, or we could just mine with gold ourselves. So, um, yeah, let's turn this wood into planks again because basic wood's a waste. Oh, look, we got exactly one stack, so I think that's perfect for that. And to, just to finish off this episode, I'm going to have a bit of a explore and I'm going to follow the coast around and see if I can find anything interesting. Get my sword to hand just in case any creepers haven't despawned quite yet. Oh, an egg that could always be useful, especially especially in spawning chicken. And also, oh yes, a melon. So we can farm melons and get a very large source of um, melon, which we can turn into various other things. Yep, it dropped five, which isn't bad. And there's spider webs as well. I won't break. Oh yeah, my hair's on these. It'd be an awful way to end an episode right at the beginning just to die. But, oh, it's a very dense forest here, so I bet. I wonder how much of this map was actually made by hand and how much was sort of left alone. Oh, so there's a chicken there. I might as well kill that. Yep, some more food. And see if I can see any more chests. A slime? Hang on, this map is probably... Oh, yeah. So this map's probably basically above bedrocks in that case. Keep away from it for a minute. I don't want to die. Arrows. That's good. And... 
Okay, let's finish the episode by killing the slime. Or the slime killing us. Hopefully not. Ah. Oh. Come on, where's this little babies? Oh. Oh, slime balls. They can always be used for good things for sticky pistons. Which can be used for automatic doors and things. Yep. So. Oh, that's good. Oh, still one remaining. Yeah, no damage taken. So, um, I'll put these back in base. And thanks for watching. And we'll see you next episode. Oh, oh, hidden chest. Yeah! Okay. That's definitely, I'd say, it's definitely advanced us a lot more. Yep, yeah, there you go. And a diamond as well. What a way to end an episode. Um, so, thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, Cindy Anna Jones out.